so we are going to begin with flour flour sugar baking powder and some cardamom or iliki today we are going to be making some mandazi so just get started and welcome to my channel if you are new here don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so we are going to add and don't forget to add a pinch of salt because salt works in sweet or savory dishes so just mix that like thoroughly until the all the ingredients are well mixed i added a, a pinch of cinnamon that is optional but i think it will make the dough richer and smoother so we are going to make a well in between and add some melted margarine or butter or cooking oil one large egg and we are going to to mix that in until we break the yolk so we are going to begin adding our milk i'm going to do half milk half water but you can do all milk but i don't prefer using water completely because the milk will give you a richer dough so consider using half half so we are going to transfer this to the bowl we are, we are using and rest it for the rest it overnight to make it smoother and richer and the ingredients will combine well and the iliki will taste better so flour lately flour your surface sorry with some all-purpose flour and divide the dough in two or four remember that you can do this if you don't have that time overnight you can just do it 30 minutes it will still be okay but it's better overnight Ooh, look at those friends there even the my cats think that this is good because it it already smells good the cardamom already smells good so just portion it in the sizes you want and the shapes i'm just going to start with some triangle it should be a little, a little bit thick i want some if you don't want a whole mandazi so you just push on this until you are satisfied so we are going to drop this in hot oil not warm hot and then cook and and then just fry until golden brown it will take about 30 seconds to one minute because my oil is super hot so just check on those this is not the time to go to the to watch tv or do anything else just do this be patient you can see how they are turning out golden brown and you can see that the baking powder is active because of the small creaks don't worry it won't affect the it won't be it won't burst that much so you're going to take this out of the oil once they are golden brown and repeat that to the second batch so i'm going to cut this into little square shapes you can see they are a bit thick and i'm just going to fry them oops so here is one of the mandazi they are super soft they are delicious they just smell so good the cardamom i think it's a really good spice but if you don't have it it's okay you can just use cinnamon but i prefer using cardamom and here are the pictures of my mandazis consider trying this recipe and enjoy